This is a pretty awesome router with some seriously cool features, including wireless AC1200 and a 4G LTE modem built into it, so you can have dual incoming internet connections, which is awesome. Stick around to find out more. Check out our website at techteamgb.co.uk for more info on both this and many other products, and also up-to-date news on all things tech. Stick around for this awesome video. So this is ASUS's 4G-AC55U. As I said, it's kind of a multi-purpose router, switch, wireless access point, and all that sort of stuff. Um, inside the box you get the wall wart with a UK and an EU power adapter, depending on where you buy it. Um, three antennas, one that comes pre-attached, they're all pretty beefy with a lot of kind of uh, adjustability to them, and they actually look pretty awesome, I, I think, anyway. Also, I got an EE SIM with mine, although it varies between where you buy it, um, and all that sort of stuff and what country you're in, so do bear that in mind. Also on the front, bottom right, you've got all the different indicators, so from left to right you have the three signal strength indicators for the uh, LTE, USB, LAN, 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz Wi-Fi activation, uh, WAN or wired internet, uh, the general wireless activity and the power indicator. Up on the top right you've got the ASUS logo and the kind of name of what it is uh, and on the back you have the sort of spec as well as the IO and a few different buttons so the IO from left to right, you've got the power button and the DC in, as well as a reset button, a USB 2 port, the WAN, or kind of wired internet in, um, the Wi-Fi on off switch, and a four port gigabit switch. This is awesome if you're just using the uh, or the SIM card on the side, as you can see in the sort of SIM tray. Uh, and also, by the way, there are a couple buttons on the right hand side for WPS and to turn on and off the uh, wireless, or the, the uh, 4G sort of, set up. So um, yeah, this is what it looks like turned on. Um, the lighting are, is pretty much constant blue um, on most of the areas. It looks quite cool. Um, and I must say that the software is very, very well, I guess, well refined. So uh, first of all, it will ask you to do a password and uh, generally just a sort of click through menu. If you're using this as a wired modem uh, or wired router with uh, your 4G SIM as a backup, then this uh, will automatically detect the current settings and set it all up for you. Um, if you're using the uh, 4G LTE as the primary because you don't have internet access at the moment, um, then it might take a few more steps, but it does work. Um, it is pretty awesome and the general sort of setup for the the, uh, the uh, browser and that sort of thing is fairly simple. Things do take a long time to kind of happen, so if you hit save it might take uh, up to a minute to actually save it and a lot of the settings that you change require the router to reboot itself so that takes up to sort of five minutes at a time but um, there's a lot of awesome settings in here and uh, if you want to see anything more or ask any questions feel free to leave those in the comments down below. Also just as a quick speed test I got about 25 meg down, uh, actually nearly 30 and about 20 up as well. So after playing around with the router a bit um, I've definitely got some experience with it and I have to say I really like it. There's a lot of features about it, especially including the, the web portal and stuff that's great. Um, things that I wouldn't necessarily even expect to have available to me are available, um, so that's fantastic. Uh, and obviously the 4G uh, SIM uh, tray and the 4G enable part is obviously the key kind of difference between this and many other routers. Uh, and it's fantastic. It's, um, it's perfect for the situation I'm in, which is I've just moved house. Um, I've got TalkTalk Talk internet on the way, but it's not being uh, activated for another week or so. Um, so, you know, even though it's a 6 gig uh, cap on the, the SIM I've got in there, um, it's still fantastic to sort of help tide me over uh, for the next week, um, just answering emails and, you know, um, things that require internet to turn on and stuff like that. Um, so it's a really nice kind of way to tide you over, um, or if you uh, often experience internet kind of dropouts, um, it's fantastic for uh, still being able to uh, you know, still have some sort of internet access uh, if your, you know, your cable or whatever uh, connection dies. Um, so it, yeah, it's, it's just really quite cool. Um, functionality and hard, uh, like uh, software-wise, as I said, is fantastic. The hardware feels really uh, nice, well built. The aerials are fantastic. Uh, Wi-Fi range seems to be pretty far, and while I can't scientifically tell you, um, it does seem to do a very good job of wireless range. Um, also, I live pretty much right next to a 4G antenna, so I can't tell you how that sort of, you know, how signal strength is far away from a. a, a 
antenna, but um, for me it was fantastic. I was getting about 25 megasecond down and about 15 to 20 up, which is fantastic. So yeah, I basically just had a really positive experience with it. And um, yeah, in terms of scoring, it's gonna be a four for five money. I can't really find too many places that you can actually buy this except for Amazon Germany, which is uh, seems to be a little bit expensive. Um, but if this, you know, if you're currently out of internet or you have, you know, uh, lots of internet blackouts, this could be fantastic for you. So definitely check that one out. In terms of everything else, um, it's going to have to get a five for all of them because uh, performance is great, especially on 4G. Um, and obviously it's gigabit, so that's great as well. Um, the functionality is great, the software is fantastic, the fact that you get the 4G antennas, you get great Wi-Fi range um, and great kind of Wi-Fi speeds, obviously AC1200 um, and then obviously the, the gigabit switch in the back as well is fantastic. Uh, styling, I really like the, the general style of it, I like the front kind of uh, wavy plastic, I just it's quite cool and uh, Touch and Beauty score is also going to be a 5. It's also going to get the gold award because it's a fantastic product that uh, is helping me uh, and can hopefully help you if you're in the same situation so uh yeah anyway i hope you enjoyed the video if you did feel free to leave a like if you didn't dislike but let me know why in the comments down below subscribe for more awesome tech stuff we've got loads of um cool stuff including giveaways and um, we've got a pg27aq from asus and um, we've got a couple of gigabyte motherboards some cooler master project stuff going on um so check all of those out uh, and don't forget to hit the subscribe button for more cool stuff um and on that check us out on facebook and twitter uh, and yeah we'll see you on the next video